Hello, everyone. We're moving right along. It's uh, the Daily Meta for January 16th. What I've been emphasizing, and we haven't moved very deeply into the book yet, but this is a very deep point, I'm emphasizing that violence is violence and nonviolence is nonviolence, and getting absorbed in the particulars of a given situation uh, isn't uh, necessarily going to help us resolve that situation or the others the dots to which uh, they are connected. And I want to emphasize something else here that comes up in this particular section called uh, the search of, for prevention. And that is that uh, since violence is violence, nonviolence is nonviolence, it affects all of us and we don't need to be specialists. I hope I've made that clear. We don't need to be specialists to be solving that, the problem. As I say, in the book, uh, it doesn't matter if we're an activist who is out there working for a whole career against an injustice or injustice more generally, or we simply want to lead a more secure existence. And that has become acutely more poignant since search came out with this rash of massacres that are going on to the extent that nobody can feel safe. In public, nobody can feel safe, really, even just driving their car down the freeway. So again, that shows another aspect of the universality of the problem, that we're all, we're all in this together, and we can all work on it together from whatever perspective, whatever position we hold. Now, I have a quote from an African uh, statesman about a murder that took place in Natal, in South Africa, and he said, violence remains violence irrespective of motivation. What a useful corrective. Think about that for a second. Every time you pick up a newspaper and it's reporting about a crime, and of course every time you pick one up it is reporting about crimes, what is the last sentence of almost all of those reports? And that is, police are still searching for a motive. But what they're searching for is not really the underlying driving dynamic, the search for dignity, the sense of separateness. They're not asking those questions. They're looking for the particular triggers in that particular case. So there again, it's a, it's a very useful uh, corrective. And uh, I hope to continue this conversation with you shortly. Meantime, once again, we're all being invited to join the experiment.